when we talk about cloud native or cloud era, you know, the whole DevOps movement, we kind of looked at, you know, breaking down old silos. Right. Uh, we also think of, you know, unicorn developers, you know, yeah. who can do everything. Yeah. That was the whole idea, right? But the fact is, that's not the reality we have, you know, that we have, you know, <laughs> dev security teams, people, and it, it has nothing to do with the role. It's about some folks, they have interest and expertise in this particular area. And you do want ex expertise in certain area. And that I feel is kind of creating, you can call it federated or, you know, kind of soft silos are still there. So, but when we talk about cloud, one more thing happening in the cloud native is that almost every company has to have a cloud or software strategy, which means that not everybody is Google, not everybody can have Google-like infrastructure. So there are a lot of companies, they have nothing to do with that, which also means that we have to simplify things for you. So how is Glueware making it easier for such folks so they can leverage all of those things without being an expert in all those areas because you know it can get very complicated very quickly. You're absolutely right. I think I read an article that said in the next few years, AWS is going to be hiring 50,000 cloud engineers. You know, if they really are hiring 50,000 cloud engineers, then we have really no hope of making all of our network engineers become coders, right? Because that, that shift of expertise isn't going to happen. So we've got to figure out how to marry those problems together. How do we start bringing to bear, you know, the unicorn you find, someone who can do it all, right? Give them the freedom and the capability to build for the custom that the, that the business needs, but yet still leverage that great experience of your network engineer and allow them to automate as well. And sort of the greatness of Blueware is they can meet you anywhere in that journey you want to be. And we have, you know, there's some new stuff coming out like RPA, low code, no code, right? You can get into Glueware without having to be an expert, understanding what your expertise, which is being a good engineer, and you're, you're able to link all the different things that you want to do together, whether it's config, OSM, right? Whether it's audit and compliance, and you're able to execute that automation through the tool without having to be an expert. And that low code, no code approach, whether it's building a, you know, a robotic process automation or whether it's just doing an inventory and an audit, that stuff comes you know, standard out of the box, which is impressive, right? Because you don't have to be an Ansible expert. You don't have to be a Python expert to get the benefit.